Soul there, and welcome to Turmoil, a game about oil digging, mining, oil mining, that's the word. So, this is a little indie game, uh, it is about, well, it's about oil drilling. Yeah, there we go, simple enough. I'm going to play a single game just to show you the game off, uh, maybe we'll come back and do a campaign run if you're interested, let me know, but uh, a single game, sort of um, a sandbox run. That's the currency that I'm playing with. So, let's go straight into the game and have a look. So you get one full year to play the game, and you've got these little things. You've got a scanner, a mole, and a dowser to find oil. I have to put a couple of dowsers down, there we go. And to get oil out of the ground, you have your rig, you have a silo to store excess that you can't sell, and you've got your horses to uh, drag them to and sell the stuff. You can also speed up the horses with the little category there. This guy is now waving his hand around, going, hey, I found some stuff. So, very quickly, I'm going to use the scanner to try and find the stuff. Boom, there goes. Little scan there. And none there. So, little scan there. And, whoa, look at that. That's a big area as well. It's an entire scan area. So, we'll put a rig on top of there. Boom. Drag down a little pipe down to there. And start mining it. Now, if we put down a couple of carts, we go with W, wagons, and say, both of you go over there and sell. As soon as it mines, they'll start immediately extracting the oil. So while they're doing that, because uh, it's useful if they do that for us, we'll start scanning over here and see if we can find out what he's uh, talking about. The good news is we have money coming in now, so we don't have to worry about this guy. And there's another set of oil right there. Now I could drop another rig down top of him, or I could run another pipe from there to there. And I'm going to do that because it's a little bit more efficient. Well, because I still have to run the pipe anyway, but I've got one rig right in the middle of the map right now. And that's more beneficial to me, which is excellent. Uh, we'll have to watch out for the fact that there are two supplies in, it will overflow, and if it overflows, well, we get in trouble. So let's put out another cat, and we'll add an extra one of these, and the two buildings we can sell to. Left Comp and Right Ink. And this is how much they pay for oil. This little bar going up is, well, it's how much oil is in that, side, that well right now. And if that goes to the top, it will overflow, and you will get fined for it. So you've got to keep an eye on that. Now this is a big... PC. If we actually upgrade the pipe, make it a bigger pipe, pump it out faster. The problem is it will overflow. So what I'll do is I'll press S and get a silo, pop a silo down, boom. Doesn't make a difference if it's or not. The only way oil moves is if a cat takes it. So to top that off a little bit more, I'll buy another cat, but I won't allocate it to pump out. So I've even said three, I have to go here, none to there, because this has got the best prices right now. And I got four in total. The one that's not doing anything, his only job is to put oil into the silo. That's his only job. And because of that, I can click on there and upgrade that pipe. Now, when they're off selling the oil for us, he can be taking the excess and putting it into that silo. So we don't have to worry about overflowing, which is a big, important problem when you get to... As you get, see how, how fast it's filling up? Yeah, that's the problem. If it fills up too fast, we've got another cat down there. Go, oh, free I'm going to need an extra one right now. Yeah, there we go. So they can definitely keep it keep it topped up. Keep an eye on the silo. They, if the silo gets full, it can be upgraded. But if the silo gets full, they won't be able to put any more oil in. And you will get into a situation where it all flows. You see how high we are on the rig right now? It got really high. So I'm going to put down another two of those guys. Just to make sure we don't end up going over. And we are now cheaper. Uh, better, sorry, not cheaper. More expensive to put it over there. Let me get... I kind of like to go full 10 and do 5 and 5. There we go. Just keep an eye on that, on that though. Uh, okay, let's get some more dowsers in while we're waiting. Because it's best to have some dowsers going. They do cost you 100 when you place them down. But they don't cost you anything while they're doing the job. And they don't cost you anything while they're waving their hands and anything. Hey, there's a thing here. So best stop plan ahead and get the guys doing it. There we go. I'm just going to pop down. There's one. And you. And there. You can, by the way, just let it get bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger. But there's not really a point if you can get it a little small. So, there we go. So, we have two more down here. Also, the silo's filling up really, really rapidly right now. So, let's pop down a whole bunch of new uh, horses and get them over, get them selling that oil as fast as they can. Because we now have ten horses carrying uh, oil to be sold and five just keeping that silo under wraps right now. Which is kind of perfect for us right now. But we do have two, and they look quite big as well. So I'm going to give them a rig. Just tap that area. There we go. Tap that with both of those two pipes. And I'm just quickly scan these how deep they are. 
Whoa, that's a big one. Alright, that's a more medium size. That's quite large. This one... Put it down to some more dowser, please. Okay, we've got two large pipes here. That one, however, if you look, there's no oil flowing through it. We have sucked that entire one dry. It's good to know. It means we, that means we don't have to worry about that one anymore. If anything appears over here, we can just join off of this connection, which is excellent to know. He's found something new for us, so we're going to quickly have a scan. And... Ooh, okay, we found some rock. This is actually uh, solid rock. You cannot drill through solid rock without buying the upgrade. Have you actually not found anything? Because... I can't see anything on your path right there. And they always have it directly below them, but it doesn't... It's like 90% chance it's going to be there. Hmm... I don't trust you right now. I don't, I don't see anything there. You, however, have probably a better chance of finding something. Oh, there it is. No, that looks like... Let's have a look. Yep, the white stuff is gas. So we've got gas there. Uh, but there is oil right there. But I can't go there. If I try and go there, this will actually happen. Actually, I'm going to upgrade both for you two. We hit a uh, solid rock. We can't go through that. So I'm going to say upgrade that well so it can drive through the solid rock. There you go. Now we can drill through the rock. Excellent. Which means we can actually get to this little bit down here. Probably don't need to get to this little bit down here, but we can do if we want to. Oh, there might be a tiny little bit there. No, I don't think you've found anything of use to me. Um, I don't know how we're going to go and just play this little bit here, but I don't think now. He, I don't think he has found anything. But I'm going to do that, however. I'm going to drop a couple of moles down with M. Moles. They will dig down and sort of expose sections. Whoa! Over here. That little ticket sound you heard just then was this well overloading. It was actually, actually overloading it. Look how fast it's going up. So definitely can see that. Give me a few more of those guys down. And also, get me all of them over here selling. Apart from the 10 I don't want to do. That's, that's, that's the fast way I found of doing it, by the way. Stop that from overflowing, guys. Come on. Drain it. There we go. Can we drain it fully? Thank you. So, we are draining this area. Um, can I have another couple of dowsers down, please? Thank you. So, we're draining these two areas now, happily. But we can easily overwhelm this one, because two upgraded pipes is a lot of oil to be shifting to keep this place from overflowing. And we're draining this one still, don't forget. So, we've got to be careful with that. Okay, the moles didn't find anything new for me to worry about, so I think he's lying to me. And he will disappear over time if he is lying, but he won't disappear otherwise. We're 94 over there, good. Uh, if we do actually overload, we can shut down the uh, pipe, but uh, it's only if, you, if you're getting overwhelmed. Also, the silo is getting a bit full, so let's upgrade that. There we go. Uh, Dowsers are still running around. If they wander off the map without telling me there's anything new, that means there's nothing new on the map. And it's as simple as that. They will leave if there's nothing new found. I don't actually know what happens if you drill into the gas. You know what, let's have a bit of fun. Drill into the gas. And... Okay. Does... Oh, so it, well, as that's draining, no oil's getting through. At least that's what it looks like anyway. Uh, yeah, that well is not producing oil right now. Well, put it from here, but not through that one. Ah, okay. I could just also... shoot it down, which doesn't appear to be working very well, but there we go. Okay, so drilling into gas, not advisable. Also, these guys have left. He's still telling me there's more oil here, which I found that bit down there. Already, there's nothing there. I'm going to do a little bit of a uh, stair. Oh, right there. I would not have found that with that bit there. But there we go. We found an extra piece right there. And the other guys have left. They're telling me there's no more oil on the map. Uh, we've also... Let's put that to maximum now. There we go. We've also hit the zone, so I'm going to upgrade that one and go down there and grab that. Also, I'm going to upgrade that little piece there to get the oil out faster. Because we're in August, actually, we don't really need to upgrade, to tell you the truth. But it's not, it's not even a big well, so we'll just sort of drive pretty quickly on this one. Oil is flowing down there, but it does stop pretty quickly once the well starts up. And... I don't think we about that. Yeah, it's only a small one there. So, it's a fast forward by holding down the button here. And, ooh, this one's actually doing much better on price right now. There we go. 
And that's what I would have. We could actually hold out and sort of stock some of it in the uh, silo, but there's not really a reason to do so. Uh, the game will end, this, this particular sandbox levels end at the end of December. Uh, but your goal is obviously to uh, try to get as much of the oil off the map as you can. So, we can almost drain that one entirely. And I've got everyone just running over there to sell as much as they can. Ooh, this one's actually much more, uh, well, much more useful right now. This one's got, it's, it's worth more, basically. So, there we go. And we are now entirely out of oil. The dowsers ran off, which means they didn't find any more. Which means, obviously, there isn't any more. Unless, actually, maybe there might be a little bit deeper here. But that's covered up again. It, I think this actually, I'm not sure. I think this gets deeper as you scan. But get those guys running around. If they find anything, we'll try and mine it as fast as we can. But I don't think they will. So, let's keep an eye on them. Boop, 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 guys. No, they don't go find anything. The guy just left. The guy on this side is gone. Yeah, they've, they haven't found anything. It's entirely done. We're in the last month, as you can see on the top left corner now. And we're just uh, fast forward through the rest of the month. I do wish there was a sort of way to skip to the end once you thought, I'm done. But uh, you kind of have to hold down the fast forward button. And the music sort of speeds up as well. As you know. Yeah, there we go. When it gets to the very end of the month, the map is revealed, and you are shown how good or bad you did. As you see, we did pretty well. We spent, we earned 30,000, we spent 13,000, we got bonuses for taking all of the oil out of the map, and a bonus for selling all of our oil for the non that was in the silos, and our total profit was that. We get a nice little graph that shows how our oil... Okay. It flickers up because they're over it. We get a nice little graph that shows us how our initial expenditure went down as we started spending money to get oil out. And then when we sort of locked down those second, that second well and upgraded all the pipes, we got a massive increase. And then of course, we deplete all the oil at this point here. Our earnings shows you how you were sold it to each company, an average price you sold it at. Your spending tells you roughly how you broke down. I spent more, more money on scanners because I was trying to find that one last well. And I'm glad I did. Because although I probably spent a bit more money than I wanted to, I did get the extra bonus for cleaning the entire map. Uh, and that's a screenshot. There's our map. Yes. So, we can give it another go, but this time, single game. You've got all these different modes. You can just play an old oil, which is just a map of oil, that's it. You've got the ones with rocks and diamonds, you've got rocks, diamonds, and gas, and rocks, diamonds, and, and a thermal upgrade. The thermal upgrade means you can dig faster. Pop down two of those guys, which I always do just two of those guys initially, just get them going. Because I wonder if we'll find it fast or not. There we go. Give me that. Not there. Good. Okay, there. No, right here then. Okay, our first well is going to be quite a deep one, so... Going down for the initial investment, and I can see immediately there's a uh, stone in the way. Uh. Uh, let's send it that way a minute. I don't want to spend too much money on trying to find it. Well, there we go. Go. Uh, give me a couple of wagons before I run out of money, because you can do that. If you if you, if you you invest too much in piping and not enough in actually getting to the uh, oil, you can actually get to either the point where you don't have enough money to build pipes or enough money to actually get wagons to do the job. There we go. All right, so I'm going to upgrade immediately, upgrade that pipe. Just start extracting more. That will help us initially, but uh, when that one completes there, we'll have twice as much oil coming through and two lorries, lorries? Two wagons, grabbing as much oil as we can. So go. And there we go. Now we're extracting it a lot faster than we were originally. So, and they've done that because this is a big one. Now you can go to, there is a tier three. I'm not going to touch tier three just yet. But I am going to spend a bit of money right now and get these two, get more dowsers down. Because I'm going to be working here almost entirely, I think, at the moment. Uh, yeah, we're filling these wagons pretty quickly, which is excellent to see. I do want an extra couple of those guys down, and those guys have already found something new. Excellent. Uh, let's get those guys selling as well. There we go, and we'll start some recon over here. I will put down just a couple more, see what they look like. A couple of moles, there we go. Let them go do their job while we uh, start extracting over here. I'm also going to spend... That's the thermal upgrade, by the way. Faster drilling speed. And then drill through rock. I'm going to spend that now, because I know... That I can get to that well there if I can just get to it, which is uh, through rock. But uh, I'm gonna get access to it now and start draining it off pretty quickly. And there we go. Once that goes in, it won't be able to extract at full rate if it gets in the way of you know this is pipe here is constraining the flow right now. So there's got two there, a two wide there, a two wide there, and a one wide there. So obviously this pipe has to give on its capacity. Which is fine because this isn't actually a big 
Well, and it'll run out pretty soon anyway, so it's not a problem. We could upgrade that pipe to a tier 3 pipe. Although, look at that. We've already found a massive well over here. But I don't want these guys to be traveling too fast. I'm going to put down another well there. And a silo right next to it. And then one, two, three. Yeah, put down three of those guys. Their job is just going to be keep that silo full. Uh, I'm also going to tell you guys not to sell right now and to sell over here instead because you guys make more money over there by quite a substantial amount as well. There we go. And the thing is that long run is going to cripple us for that overflowing which is why these guys will pump it into the into the silo itself. And this is the guy, the blue little carriage that you know is selling to blue, red ones say turn to red and the grey ones tell you they're just literally selling. Now we've got some cash. I'm going to run this well down to here and then onto there. I've done it in two pieces purposely because I want to be able to break off to whatever this guy's found if we find it nearby. I mean, we might actually hit it on the way, which would be even better if we do. But you never know. Uh, we are in match, so we've got plenty of time on that the front. That one there is draining nicely. Um, I could make that one wider. It would pump out the oil on both of these a bit faster, but it probably overall look well my current trucks. Um, I don't know. So we could scan down here and see if we can find that extra. Ooh, it might actually be higher up. See, look, there it is, and just see the edge of it. So I'm going to run that one down to there and upgrade that pipe just so it makes sure it's got double capacity on it. But now we're at a situation where we've got too much going on. Pop down a few more of those guys and bring that up to five. Five filling up the silo, five selling. Nice combination to get going on there. And there we go. Immediately, we have two guys over here. He actually, interestingly, he hasn't disappeared. Which means the one we've tapped isn't the one he found. Ah, interesting. So let's just pop down that there. That there, there, and there. And see if we can find an extra one that we don't know about. Because it's possible there's one I don't know about that he uh, started trying to teach us about. Well, that's one that we know about. We tapped into that one. Um, I mean, there's not going to be one of these. These are too small. Uh, but... Ah, <laughs> look at that. So I can tap down into there now. And have an extra one there. That's going to overwhelm our pipe right now. Uh, because that's actually a tier 2. Which you can do with all three of these in one go. So watch this. And connected. Three of those saturates that one pipe. Excellent. It does, however, mean we have to keep an eye on prices, and we do, we have, well, we are giving away right now money. There we go. So we're starting to sell the other side. We're down to 32 cents on the left, but the reds on the right are doing 98 cents. So we are making a lot more money right now. I also decided to get five more horses just because it was better for us. But let me get some more of these guys uh, searching around. There we go. And I'm going to actually spend a bit of money on a speed upgrade, just to get those horses moving a little bit faster. And immediately they've drained the silo as well, <laughs> excellent. And we're up to one dollar four on the uh, red side, so it's excellent as well. Oop, you found me some more oil of you. Thank you. Let's have a look at your uh, supply. Uh, there it is, okay. The good news here is we can tap that one straight into there, where that was about to dry up. Yes, and you found me some more over here. Wow, this is a big map. Uh, is it down here by any chance? There, actually, right there. Okay, uh, looking at this, I'm going to upgrade that one to tier 3. Because, <laughs> you know, reasons. And that's a, wow, that's a big, big one as well. I'm going to drag that down a direct line into that one. Because that is going to be... I don't want to upgrade that pipe anymore and suck everything out of these. So, we'll do that. And we'll probably shut that one down, maybe, to get that one drained faster. I don't know. But I do want more horses on on run right now, so let's drop down an extra five horses and get them selling over here. There we go. I got keeping five on the actual silo right now. Uh, this is a smaller one, so I want that one to be the one that goes over here, <coughs> and that should hopefully do its job. This looks like quite last. I'm going to upgrade that one and upgrade that one, and that will help me drain that one faster. This is huge, so I don't know if we're going to be able to drain this one in time. But I'm also going to put down a couple more dowsers because at this point in time, I need them to actually find me anything on the map 
And if we drain these, I will dra put that well into this one just to help drain it faster. But we are doing remarkably well actually on uh, on Dowsridge coverage, we'll call it. Dowsridge? That that doesn't sound like a right one. Who's waving? You're waving. Uh, give me a search here, blade, and then here. Right there. Wow. Okay, and it's a uh, medium size, so I'm gonna take it from that one. There. Go. No reason to do that, but I can shut down that one. There we go. And the flow doesn't stop. Okay. That's interesting. I thought it would actually stop the flow. But there we go. That one's now pumping. Uh, I would really wish that would stop flowing. But no, okay. Uh, we'll upgrade that one when that's empty. So we can pump out this one as well at a higher speed. We're not at risk of actually running out of any uh, overflowing anything, which is excellent to see. But you never know. Uh, we're in July right now, so I do want to get this one empty. Can I just get a bit more visibility how much we've got to go on? Ah, not too much on that one. That's good. That's a small one anyway. Uh, I'm going to drop another dowser down just to make sure we get all of it. This, however, looks like it's a huge one. There we go. I'm going to upgrade... Mm, yeah, upgrade that. Get that one upgraded. There we go. Because uh, that's going to be empty pretty soon by the look of that. Yeah, that one's that's virtually gone now, so that's going to be excellent. When that one dries up, hopefully we can start sucking oil out of here. Upgrade that one. No reason to do that, but that... Wow, we cut through that one pretty quick, haven't we? Look at that. Yes! And those guys are running around still. I can't actually see them right now. But I'm assuming they are. Uh, let's upgrade... In fact, we can run that one to there. Upgrade that pipe. And then we got twice as much coming out of this pipe here. But two ways for the oil to go, you see. Ah, you see. Thinking, thinking, thinking. Over here, that one's completely dry, so I could... Mm, I could bring a pipe down here and sort this a bit faster, but there's no point, because we can do what we're doing here. Uh, we are in August, so I think we're pretty good on the bit to drain this, so let's just speed these guys up a bit and keep an eye on that uh, pricing, see how it goes. We're at $1.699 on the other side. We're making quite a lot of money this time around as well, which is actually really good to see. Uh, almost dry on the left hand side, and really, really, there we go. It's dry. That one is now completely dry. This is our only source of oil right now. Uh, we're not told We don't need to upgrade that one. These, however, I don't actually know how deep these are. That one's nearly done. That one's nearly done. Let's bring that down to there, and basically get that one, which is going to actually. There we go. Bought the upgrade just before I hit the this stone. Just help drain that one a little bit faster. Uh, don't need to upgrade it. We're in October, November, December. Ah, we're fine. That'll, that'll drain pretty quickly. But don't spend the extra money on that one. Wow, that, that one on the left down to 30 cents, 40 cents now. It's shooting up pretty quickly, actually. Uh, what we can do here is actually shut down all sales for a moment. Let them to fill that silo up. And to keep an eye on the prices. Because we can actually, if we go do it right. There we go. And $1.15. Go. Sell over there. Sell, 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 sell. And they will immediately all run over there with maximum amount of oil and set it for $1.22. Wow, we just made a quite a large profit on that compared to what we would have made if we just left it alone. And there we go. All the oil sold. The guides have run off, so they're not uh, saying any more on the map. All we're going to do now is wait for the end of December. We've actually drained the entire map. The fact is, if you drain the map early, then you're, you're wasting money on extra pipes. Um, because obviously, if you're pumping out the ground faster, then there you go. And. We did it! We took the entire map dry. Excellent, excellent, excellent. So again, we made 48,000. We spent 17, got the bonuses for draining the entire map. Profit of 33,000, excellent. As you can see, our graph shows when I started upgrading pipes as a mass, an exponential curve basically kicked in there. And then we put that, is when I stopped them uh, selling, and then when I made them sell everything. <laughs> to see the graphs actually each other's spending and earning. Actually, look at our spending. It sort of tapped off there. Just as we started getting a massive increase in, prof in uh, profit, we stopped spending money. Yeah, that's how it works. Our earnings shot up massively. Our actual cash levels. We didn't get any spillage fines, so we're good. The supply in the map. That, I'm assuming that's something comes back at some point when you uh, scan deep. I don't know how that bit works, but... Uh, whether that's us detecting new oil, or whether that's actually oil being generated on the map as we scan more, I don't know. 
the price of the oil seemed to vary quite substantially for the blue, but we were supplying the right most of the time, I believe. There we go. Uh, our earnings, 90 cents per barrel on the right, 93 on the blue. Ooh. And our spendings, again, I spend most of my money in scanners naturally. Um, I spend quite a lot of money on scanners, generally speaking, anyway, because I like to scan before I drill. You can just go blind drilling. I mean, if you imagine when I put a scan and you found that one and that one, I could have just gone drill, 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 drill until I found it, and then do a vertical drill and down if I needed to. Might try doing that next time. Let me know what you think. If you want to see any more of this game, I will happily play it. I will possibly try doing a campaign run, of which I have not really done one yet. So let me know what you think. And until next time, comments in the comments. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.